What is going on guys? It is your boy TKD one today here back again on PlayStation Source with another episode of Road to Part 2. The Last of Us podcast that we go over Last of Us and Last of Us Part 2, any and all things Last of Us and Last of Us Part 2. With me, my luxurious co-host, Starks, what's poppin'? Uh, how's it going? Happy Halloween. Well, it is. It is. It's Halloween. Halloween today. Yeah, it is. I mean, it is. It is 6 p.m. Dog. I've just been playing games. I got off class a little bit early. I don't have any plans Halloween. as of yet, but I know if 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 past Halloween's of me being in the college has uh, any indication, you know, is that eventually mm -hmm. I will get plans. I'm assuming around eight o'clock. So, um, you know, that's how my Halloween is going. But you know, I, I mean, this may sound a bit ignorant or may, you know, be like a really ridiculous question, but like, does Canada do Halloween? Like, 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 what's the deal? Like, <laughs> no, what? I'm being, you know, I don't do. know if it's a global, bro. I don't know. Don't. It is a global. I, I know it's not a heavy Caribbean thing. I know oh, right. that yeah, because right, right. I don't believe in that kind of demons and all that nonsense. Yeah. Yeah. And maybe yeah. Even China, but I know, I know, Amer like, I know, you know, Canada, you know, uh, freaking I'm assuming England, the UK, US, yeah, okay. They all Australia, yeah, pretty much. Eh, like everyone does it. I would say so, yeah. I mean, I mean, I don't know. You know what? What? What's your favorite candy? <laughs> well, candy or chocolate or both? However you want to define it, you know, because I have one. I don't that consider I think candy are... chocolate, so if that's what you're asking. That. I, Okay, wait, I huh? I know, I know. It's you don't weird, consider it Well, no, I mean, cause like you know, I can, I guess I can kind of see that, cause like a full like Hershey bar, right? Like technically, yeah, okay, I, I guess that's candy, but I don't necessarily see it as candy. Like I see that as chocolate. Yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, so for me, for me, they're very like changeable. I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, candy and chocolate are, are kind of different for me. Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. But my favorite Halloween candy, I would say. Sorry, I was away from my mic there. Um, is either uh, that that oh crap the corn one with the three colors like the uh, not, candy not corn? corn. Oh, crap! No, 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 it's oh hold oh, on. I was gonna what say, was bro. I, I was gonna vomit if you like candy. Corn. Oh, no, no, Dog. it's it's yeah, isn't it cold? It's the one with the three stripes. It's oh like my God, uh, it freaking orange. Yeah, white, and white and uh, red or something. Dude, candy corn is disgusting, I, bro. <laughs> is that what it's called? Yeah. Well, at least oh. that's how that's how I know it to be called candy corn. Yeah, and then I also like rockets, but chocolate is I prefer. I don't like candy. I prefer chocolate. Rockets? What the hell's rockets? Um, oh, Kit Kats, um, Coffee Crisp, uh, that other one, Crunchy. Anything that doesn't have peanuts because I can't eat peanuts. Oh, are you uh, allergic to peanuts? Unfortunately, so. Yes. Oh, I didn't yeah. know that. Interesting wrinkle about you. Interesting. Interesting wrinkle. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Now I know when you're, uh, you know, when I when I want you off the show, I'm just gonna <laughs> mail you a mail you a whole jiffy. Uh, a whole jiffy peanuts, yeah. Yeah. My I have other allergies too, actually, which is funny. My favorite can I'm actually allergic to nothing that I know of so far. Mm -hmm, yeah. I, I've not found anything that I'm allergic to in my 21 years of life. But uh, my favorite candy. I feel like a lot of people give me a lot of shit for it, but you know, I'm gonna stand by it. You know, I like dots. You ever heard of dots? I have not heard okay. of dots in my life. Dots fire. I'm sure you've heard of Skittles. Yeah. Yeah, 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 of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Skittles, 10 out of 10. I think I just like, like, fruity candy. I like candies that, like, are fruit flavored, but not, you know, obviously they're Same. not fruit, but I like a fruity type of candy. So, like, yeah, Skittles. Yeah. Fire, you know. I don't like Starburst though, you know. Honestly, I oh, can't think I, of... I kind of like Starburst. I, yeah. I kind of do. I mean, I can't think of any other, any other candies, besides. Uh, I mean, I mean, candies are fruit besides dots and like Skittles, to be honest. But mm -hmm. if we're talking chocolate, um, hmm. You just said that in New York an accent. Yeah. Chocolate. Okay, so I have some words that. I still say in like New York accent, like water, mm. quarter, chocolate, quarter. coffee. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's like some uh, it's cool. Some words still have that accent that I just hear my parents say all the time, whatever. And I don't know mm. why some words just stick with me with that accent, but mostly I have a, you know, completely obsolete New York accent, unfortunately. Yeah. Um, but in terms of chocolate, um, 
damn. Hershey's are fire. Kit Kats are fire. You know? It's like it's like kinda hard to get chocolate candy wrong. You know what I'm saying? It's very yeah. difficult. I feel like there's 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 an abundance more of good chocolate than bad chocolate, you know? I agree. I agree. But you and know the only where- kind of chocolate stuff that I don't like is that oh that that oh crap it's like a brown it's not licorice but it's like a, it's almost like toffee it's like i forget what it's called oh, though and oh. it's like a white and, and brown wrapper i know what you're talking it almost, about it, i know what you're talking it, about. it's roundish it's like cylinder it's like a cylinder oh wait are you talking about a klondike bar no 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 no, no. huh i'm trying to remember oh, crap i, I thought you were talking about klondike this was a tea it's like a it's like a toffee kind of thing. Those stuff, I mean, I like. I don't like those things. Hmm. Okay, I don't hmm. like. Yeah, it's hard and it's very yeah. doesn't taste like. I yeah. mean, overall, to me, like Halloween is like one of my least favorite holidays, if not my least favorite holiday. Quite honestly, like, it, wait, is it a holiday though? Yeah, I mean, technically, oh, right? it is? I mean, yeah, yeah. I guess yeah. it's not traditional, but yeah. I guess it's not yeah. like a oh, like stores are closed down for it, but you know, like it's mm-hmm. a. Yeah, 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 definitely. A lot of people celebrate. I put it, yeah. I put it like in the realm of like I guess Valentine's Day. Even though Valentine's Valentine's Day is like a little bit more, a little bit more. Well, I guess that's not even the official holiday of February because it's President's Day in the U.S. Right, right, right. But I digress. Besides the candy and the Valentine's Day and the and the and the President's Day, of course, this is Road to Part Two. And, you know, as we've gotten these, uh, you know, these these new looks at the game with the revealed, you know, the uh, release date trailer that is now, you know, not even factual because the game got delayed, unfortunately. Mm-hmm. Uh, check out our episode on that as well, um, where we talk a lot about Ubisoft delays, too, which happened at the same time, which was also that pretty was... interesting, uh, yeah. you know, but. My the homie Starks provides with the link that we're talking about today. Yeah, pardon me. I was the, the whole intro. I was looking for this thing. I'm like, where is this thing? And then good. I finally found it. Because if you guys aren't aware, uh, we I mean, I first got wind of this, uh, you know, theory, uh, via the PlayStation Source Discord and one of the channels we have a Last of Us channel. Make sure to go check out that link below in the description. Join the Discord, uh, and uh, you know, you know, you can join the conversation with us and talk about Last of Us in that specific channel on the Discord. But it was the boy Owen again. Shout out to Owen, longtime yeah. fan of the series, yeah. big homie. Shout out to him. Uh, he's the one that prompted my attention personally to this. I think it was at work. I was definitely at work. Yeah, and yeah, like, yeah, you were. And uh, this this started popping up. I'm like, oh man, this is uh, this is you know because here's the thing, right? I love, you know, I love speculation, right? I love uh, theorizing about what things are going to be, you know what I'm saying? Based off of the evidence that we have right now, right? Big, big fan of that, right? But then there's some instances where we get some theories that are a bit too on the nose for me that make a little bit too much sense. You know what I'm saying? You know? Mm -hmm. Follow me. I like my theories with like some holes in it, you know. Spin, yeah, yeah, some yeah. yeah they're it. like, okay, like you know, this could like an Uncharted Four is Sam Drake bad, exactly kind of thing, which I think was supposed to be the initial storyline until they revamped it. But anyway, it was, yeah, 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 it was. Yeah. I actually have Jason Schreier's book on my shelf, uh, Blood, Sweat, and Pixels. Oh, dude, I stopped reading that thing. I haven't even started yet. I lost like, a lot of respect for Jason. Really? Over, I don't know why. I like him now, but. I bought the book. Is a quick story. Absolutely. I, unfortunately, I didn't get the hard copy because I don't know if there is any. I got. I I hate when I buy books. Like I don't read books often, but when I do, I, I really like. I spend money on good books, and this right. was one of them. I was like, okay, it's not a hard copy book. It's one of those paper ones. And I went. I brought it to a trip to Toronto, mm. uh, downtown, where we went to this island, Center Island, and that day it was raining. And when I saw, when I looked at my my bag i was like oh my gosh my book is ruined and i was really upset actually funny story my copy of blood Sound pixels not hardcover also got ruined by water partially really yeah okay. it's not completely <laughs> ruined like uh, i need to read it though but i'm not into books too was, much i'm more into comics and yeah even I those i don't even read i just waste my money on books to be honest to me it was just the edges but there is a chapter on last of us which i would love to like you know kind of dissect oh really i never knew i oh, thought wait, it was no, only there in four from now uh, i'm an idiot i saw Druckman through the pages and i'm like oh wait is there a chapter about last nah, of us no, I, I think it's just uncharted four yeah yeah 
And, that was um, disappointing. I'm like, no, I want more Naughty Dog. No, what what is a chapter that I really I really want to read in this uh, book is Star Wars 1313, because I was mm-hmm. so so incredibly excited about that game. You have no idea, and that was that was the one cancellation that I was like visibly upset. I was like, I never Dude. even heard about that game. <gasps> Okay, yeah. that's that's another time. That's a, that's for another day, if I may. Yeah. But uh, you know, going back to it, right? You know, as wait, how did we get onto the book thing? Besides, oh, because um, I'm I'm so you, uh, <laughs> sorry. On chapter four, and then uh, Sam being bad. That's where Amy Hennig first oh, you know, yes, unveiled yes, that yes, Sam was. Yes. Yeah, yeah, all that. Cool, <laughs> got it. Okay, back on track. Right. I like yeah. my theories like a tennis racket, if you will. You know what I'm saying? Plenty of holes yeah, yeah. to poke through. But this one right here, we have. Seems a little bit too on the nose, which is funny because the tweet says something about nose. But beside the point, right? Uh, in the, you know, Starks, I would like you to close your eyes, right? Can you? Can we both close our eyes for a second here? Okay. Anyone? A- anyone <laughs> listening to the podcast, close your eyes, right? Except mm-hmm. if you're driving. If you're driving, keep driving. If you're no, not driving, if you're driving, still close your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> close your eyes. Jerk the wheel ninety degrees. Beside the point. Okay. I would like to take us back to the release mm. date trailer of Last of Us Part 2. Great trailer. Okay. Saw a lot of cool things. And if you recall, we have that scene where Ellie is grabbed forcibly by some people that we speculated to be possibly Fireflies, possibly some other faction. But they seemed, uh, you know, there was something that we referenced in the breakdown about their clothing uh, not not being uh, of uh, the... Hold on. Let me get this right. Sephrites. Absolutely. Huh? Seraphites, huh? dude. You're joking. Sephrites. Seraphites. You're joking. I really Sarah. S E R A. Seraphite. I thought uh, I got that right. I it doesn't to... matter. I, I like when you say Sephrite, to be honest. I swear kind of to God, I'm, nev- I'm never going to get it right. The <laughs> Seraphites, right? We uh, thought that the clothing of this uh, gentleman that grabbed Ellie and, like, you know, did all that, whatever, uh, wasn't, you know, Seraphites. So Are we point? supposed to have our eyes closed still? Or. Wow, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, still <laughs> still closed, especially if you're Sorry, driving. Said. Just kidding. Yeah. Okay, back back to it, right? Uh, we have, yeah. you know, Ellie uh, pinned down on the floor. They're doing something mm. in front of Ellie. We don't know what it is. We don't get to see it. We hear a gunshot, and then the uh, echoes of no... Of, uh, you know... Ellie, Ellie, like, <laughs> I'm sorry, that was just fucking cringe. I'm sorry. You, you, you want me to do it again? <laughs> I have a lot of energy sure. today. I'm going to do it again. No... <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it as was you all a lot recall, louder than that. Right? No! <laughs> oh, anyway, um, uh, as you yeah, recall that, continue. right? So you know there was a lot of speculation, right? Mm-hmm. And uh, the the main theory that a, a lot of people ran with was the fact that like maybe Dina was killed there. I would like to know what you thought. You know, before we get into initially, the initially I was like, oh my god, are we are we looking at is our theory dog really doing this? Wait, who? And then I. No, Naughty Dog. Oh, oh, sorry. Okay. Naughty Dog. Um, gotcha, gotcha. Now, but then there's something that took me back. It was a YouTuber um, who makes who makes PlayStation videos. Mm. Um, and he said, Are Naughty, is Naughty Dog tricking us or something in between those lines? And then I read into it. I'm like, you know what? It's way too obvious. And we've seen it with Uncharted 4, just the way they've, they've done certain things. Like there was a lot of stuff in the trailer that was just different. You know, the whole conversation with Rafe saying, you know, drop all your bags, and, you know, or we're going to, you know, go back home, live your life, or we'll end it right here. When he said, we'll end it right here, he never even, I don't think he even said that in the game. And if he did, it was through, a, it was some phone call he had with Nathan. He wasn't actually in front of him. So that wasn't actually a cutscene. So there's a lot of stuff in the trailer, in the Uncharted 4 trailer that wasn't, that was just different. Right. So I think Naughty Dog is attempted to do the same with this, where it makes it seem like Dina died there. I mean, it's definitely a possibility, and I thought it was initially, but I now that I think about it, I don't think that's the case. Hundred percent. Yeah, and like, and and to like speak also to add support to your you know um, statement that like Naughty Dog is definitely uh, you know ones to lead you in one way in trailers, and then like completely flip the script in the full game. Similar actually to MCU trailers. You know what I'm saying? Like MCU trailers, mm. they're notorious. Yeah. You know, for like completely just lying or removing people from trailers 
that are, that are that that are there in that shot in the full yeah. movie. Like it's it's famous. Like like, like they do that. You know what I'm saying? Or mm -hmm. there's that famous at the end of uh, the first Infinity War trailer when they're running in Wakanda slow motion. Bum, that's bum, yeah bum, bum. yeah not in the movie at all. By the way, uh, I I just had to do that. Sorry. I swear on my life, Infinity War that first trailer might be either my second or my favorite trailer of all time i think that is my oh no no no! it's a perfect trailer. The dark the dark knight rises i watched like a hundred times dude. dude so i don't know but that <sighs> trailer mean, when i was i remember i was in my law class and i was in fucking tears for me i couldn't believe, i was shaking all over the place i just felt so complete i remember the infinite yeah. oh my god watching that trailer was magical but another trailer that yeah. i also love in the door before i get back to part two stuff um, mm -hmm. is The Force Awakens. I can't tell you oh, yeah. how many times I cried to that trailer, honestly. Really? Wow, and yeah. this new one I'm with Rise of Skywalker, honestly. I haven't seen the trailer. Oh my God. It, it, Dude, I, I because I have, well, I, I try to do it, like I try to do my film stuff on my on another channel, so I wanted to do a reaction, but unfortunately it's, it's too late to do a reaction now, so I think I might right. just watch the trailer up to I mean, so. though, I mean like, it, you you started to do the Avengers theme off of the uh, Infinity War trailer, so I can mm. tell you you value music in a trailer like I do. I'm telling Absolutely. you, the Rise of Skywalker music oh God, I is watch it. Liter it literally made me tear up. Like that's not a cap, like not a cap in sight. Like I'm talking post End Game, not a cap in sight. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> wow, that All was right. a that was a spoiler and a half. It. Wow, I can't believe I just spoiled that. Anyway, um, what the hell are we talking about? T Lou, too. We were talking about T Tommy. Right. We haven't actually. We haven't. I don't think we've actually provided context as to what we're talking about. Not with. at all. We're sixteen minutes in, and <laughs> not at all. So, what we were leading to, <laughs> amongst our <laughs> side discussions, uh, is of course. Uh, the part in trailer, you know, where Ellie screams, no, all that, right? <laughs> and so, uh, you know, it's it's well thought um, right now that, you know, people, th people think it's Dina. Some people were thinking it was, uh, you know, Joel, etc. You know what I'm saying? Maybe it's our homie David? David? Jesse, sorry. Jesse. Um, oh, yeah, Jesse. Uh, but, you know, I was like, guys, I don't know if we should jump to this because... This seems, like you said, too on the nose. Like, it seems like Naughty Dog is deliberately wanting us to think this is happening. You know what I'm saying? Like, famously, mm -hmm. in the original Last of Us trailers, one of the trailers made us believe that Ellie was going to kill Joel at the end of the game. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, Or, like, hate Joel for some reason. Like, some, some crazy stuff. You know what I'm saying? But we have a side-by-side -side image by the, uh, at least we're going to use this tweet as for reference i'm not sure if this is the original guy if it isn't my bad but we're going to credit this homie as the as the main guy that uh scottish gamer 19 wait what? oh you said his name in the in the irish accent okay scottish. i was so confused yeah scottish gamer no, it's supposed to be scottish it's a scottish accent it's not irish scottish well it's gamer. a little both both 19 scotland, scotland. yeah scottish gamer 90 i have I I'm not really good accent. with my accents, but I'm anyways, yeah, Scottish Gamer 19. Yeah, he uh, tweets uh, up here on the screen as well if you're watching on VOD. Is this Tommy with a buzz cut? Nose looks the same. Hashtag last was part two. And yeah. um, I tell you, man, I think he's on to something with this tweet. I think he's on to something. I think, I think he's, he's on to something. absolutely on to something. And <sighs> oh, I want to say, so if we were to go by a direct, direct comparison, you know, I'm sure you're going to have this on screen, but I am. Um, mm -hmm. Tommy, I know. Th so it's one of those things where it's like, okay, the guy on the left, the shape, the guy with no hair, beaten up, interrogated, he seems a lot younger, short, um, sh uh, perhaps even shorter or lighter than the actual Tommy. But as we know, Naughty Dog is playing uh, playing around with different timelines. So perhaps this is a timeline that explains, you know, Tommy's. Maybe that's why Tommy is saying, you know, you don't know this group. You don't know what you're going to walk into with these people because maybe he's been through that dramatic uh, uh, interrogation or this is the present. And the reason why I say or is because if you look at both of the Tommies, they both have a wound on the exact same place of their head, which I mean, it's not the exact same place, but it's pretty similar. Um, 
and you look at the eyes especially not it's not even the nose that's really similar it's the eyes dude and and the eyebrows like like the way he's squinting and stuff it looks this guy does look a lot like tommy Starks, you have such a good eye. Holy shit. I I didn't even think about the moon. I almost, you know what? Here's what I'm going to do live. I'm actually going to take this into Photoshop and up the brightness, see if I see anything crazy. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, and look at, and look at the, um, the uh, what's, what should we call it? The, um, uh, his air, especially. Yeah, now, I, I want to point out, too. Yeah. sorry, I know his I'm ear. talking a lot, but I kind of want to point out, someone mentioned his hair. Now, I do want to talk about his hairline in a sec, but his hair, is, 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 someone said, well, Tommy has what appears to be brown i don't know dirt I, i'm not good with hair color but brown i would say and brown the shaven yeah, yeah yeah and the guy on the left has black or what it appears to be black now i know when people when i see people shave their head they especially you know i mean obviously tommy's caucasian right and so i guess in a way they're going to be accurate with that i mean you know i shave my head all the time and but i have a very consistent like black color so wow. it's kind of hard to really say that but when i see my friends who are caucasian who have brown hair when they cut it and it starts to grow back it's black yeah yeah it's not brown it, the hair because the, the the brown the brown part is just the the hair a dead cell or it's dead when, when it grows out I, i'm right. not gonna point yeah. to the matter is it's brown when it grows back or black part of me it's a darker shade yeah yeah i agree yeah um until um, it fully grows back now wait are we back yeah my apologies ladies and gentlemen um so i have a couple points so if you're gonna rewatch the trailer okay okay kevin mm -hmm. if you were to rewatch the trailer i want you to point out specifically in the moment that we see this flashback of this interrogation right what commentary or who is speaking above it or is it just a flash because if someone's speaking above it and I think I think I know who's speaking above it. I think it's Tommy speaking above it. I think that's to insinuate that hey, th this might be like th this might be telling like a, a, a side of Tommy that because as we know, Tommy's experienced this world a lot more than Ellie, right? So maybe this is Tommy. Uh, one thing I wanted to talk about his hairline is when you look at Tommy, right? His hair is so weird, but underneath, especially on the right side of his hair, where the wound is, it looks like underneath just the the little hair that's kind of coming down it seems like it's gonna i know this is, sounds weird but the hair, his hairline doesn't stop there so i it definitely goes straight all the way up and then as as we see tommy's forehead area it's like a circle it's coming towards you and right. the guy who's being interrogated has the exact same hairline yeah right i, I know i know it's hard to to, to, no, to, no, to say that specifically but um you know, I think this is a great theory. And then, honestly. and then also, I mean, I mean, look, I mean, I think the most compelling evidence that this is Tommy is mm -hmm. number one, the wound, and number two, the nose, yeah. number three, the eyes. But to speak on the hairline situation, right? Um, I think the hairline does. Uh, I don't know how much evidence it adds to this person being mm -hmm. Tommy, only yeah. because we can't see Tommy's complete hairline because he has long hair. Like, exactly. He has long yeah, flowing yeah, yeah. hair. So, like, part of the front, it, it is covering his official hairline. You know what I'm saying? Right. Because it's long hair. Absolutely. Um, but I can't um, confirm as someone who used to buzz his head. Um, I think you might really? re, re I think you might remember me on camera, like having having a buzz head, you know? Be Oh yeah, I do. Hair. What happens? Yeah. Why are you growing your hair, dude? I, I mean your dude, hair looks nice. I, just, I mean I think you look great with without. Yeah. Too. I don't know why, but whenever I like go through a breakup, I always change up the hair. No idea oh, why. Sorry. You know what I'm saying? It just it, it just you know like it is what it is. But um yeah, so like I used to shave my head, and when it would start to grow, it would grow like pitch fucking black, like dark black 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 hair. But my hair, if you look at it now in person, like it's a brown. Like it's like a, it's 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 definitely like dark hair right like i'm clearly mm -hmm. like not blonde at all but like they it's like mostly like of a brown like a like a dark brown hue but but when it first starts to grow it is really really black you know what i'm saying right um and, and i think that's just like because i don't know like maybe like when it first starts to grow like it's i don't know hair science or whatever but i did pull up the trailer the part that you were talking about so if you 
will allow me. I I'll play it. And yeah, we can both sure. Hear it. And it's yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I'm gonna and then I want to add something because I actually have images of an older Tommy from the first game Fire. to see if he has that haircut. Fire. Okay. Or okay. his his hairline. Yeah, or his hairline. Anyways, play the trailer. I'm gonna play it. Roll a few. the thing. As as IGN Sydney Goodman says, roll the thing. Roll the thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna play a few seconds prior. And you should be able okay. to hear it, okay? Here we go, boys. Here we go. You can't stop me. Bro, that's a lot for... <laughs> no! <laughs> evil, evil. But yeah... That was it. Wait, where do they show the part where? Nah, that's not it. Where's oh, the I part? Oh, the, wait, 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 I see it. I see it. Sorry, I <laughs> played the wrong. Yeah, part. that's okay, I see. after that. That's why I'm like, what? Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I'm gonna play when we're on the God of War boat thing with the broken down bridge. And it's that, that, okay. Okay, ready? Definitely looks like God of War. Yeah. yeah. How large that group is. It's Tommy. Armed. That's fucking Tommy. Yeah, it's it's. After that, it's a shot of the He's guy, like, isn't you, it? You know how long, how large this group is. You know if they're armed. Now, what I do want to comment on is what the hell is on his skin? It, it looks like, it looks like it's like been like burned. Well, I was, I, it looks like hair to me. No, no way. That's hair. I that's like. See this the last I mean, last trailer. Hold on. when yeah, I mean, if you want to pull the trailer, I'm gonna actually take sure, screenshots sure, sure. as I'm recording, and then I'll uh, you know put them on the screen. Fair enough. But it looks like, I mean, they're clearly in a restroom, right? Which then indicates that, yeah, yeah. yeah they're no, they're <laughs> in the bathroom. So, <laughs> restroom, you Americans. Oh, I'm joking. Sweet. Um, <laughs> so I don't know if that places them in the same place as of this recording. If I mean, as of this trailer, you know what I'm saying? Like. I don't know if that makes sense. Like, I don't know because clearly, well, I mean, not clearly, I guess. I just don't think Ellie was in a bathroom when she got tackled and stuff. Like, it seemed like she was in like a regular room, right? No, 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 no. I think the theory here is that's Tommy either past, present, um, and definitely not future, obviously, but I by a different timeline of the game like perhaps when he gets captured maybe he gets captured by another group or whatever i don't that's definitely not the same encounter where ellie's being rus ruffled to the ground is that is that the connection people have been making because that's an awful association <laughs> the the bathroom interrogation scene is in is in some rundown park or some rundown mall or bathroom that is not the same house area where ellie gets raped presumably Wait, yeah. Ellie gets raped. What? Wait. What? <laughs> well, I'm I'm just saying, presumably, if she were to have gotten, you know, like, whatever happens even to when, Ellie, when like she got pushed down to the ground and like, yeah, 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 that's no, what, yeah, yeah. that, yeah. Um, I just, I was just guessing while I was thinking before I even saw the images that like, oh, like is she in the bathroom now? But like, no, like she's definitely not in the bathroom because the the tile's like black and white. It's like black and white tile. Oh, dude, I had a great. A great capture of the interrogation guy and then accidentally scrolled all the way back. Sorry, I keep talking. It's all good. It's all good. But yeah, like, so he's in. There's a man also that I believe is armed. Yeah, definitely armed with a yeah. gun. Holding it, like, put puts up his face a little bit, you know. But, mm -hmm. I mean, I do like the theory that, okay, like, this is, this is the context to Tommy's uh, dialogue in this part when he's talking about you don't know how many people they are. You don't know how armed they are, how dangerous they mm -hmm. are. You know what I'm saying? Because Tommy yeah. knows. Hands off of this flashback. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I do like that, but I you haven't. Know, you know what? So, go ahead. Sorry, go on. No, Actually, no, no, you go on. You finish your point. Sorry. sorry. Please, if I may. Please. You may. All right. Uh, we'll finish your. You can finish your point. I think I was going to say um, that, like. Um, I don't want I, you to forget. Yeah, I, like, hadn't thought about the pat that like other timeline that they talk about uh being mm -hmm. being some exposition to tommy you know what i'm saying yeah i just hadn't thought about that till now yeah exactly so how warm that group is um yeah it's like it has me to think i mean we, we we've kind of said that this might be bill 
this this guy who's on top of but i don't see but now that i look at this guy it's just the physique of this individual it, he's way too thin way too skinny to be tommy tommy i mean tommy's not thick but he's not he's not he's not a skinny like scrawny guy like he has some some definition to him right he's not thick um, with two c's i beg your pardon <laughs> he's not thick with two c's no 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 okay no. Land Not, joke 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 didn't land joke crash and burn joke crash and burn yeah, all right sorry. well but um I mean, <laughs> so that's what I'm saying this this could probably be this could if I'm trying to say is that if this war Tommy which it definitely seems like it could be it has to be either from a past timeline or I guess in a way a future timeline so somewhere in the game like further in the game where he's lost some of this weight I guess perhaps um or just a regular fire uh not firefly seraphite. I think I. But what I wanted to say, pardon? Go on with what you're saying. I think I cracked okay, the code. Then I, but go on. Okay, and then I, okay. I want to say this reminds me so much of Days Gone, that scene where the Rippers, right? Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Reminds me yeah. so much of yeah. Dude, we that don't want to spoil sick. Days Gone. That was a haunting, dude. That part was scary. Listen, that's why I don't. I'm not a huge fan of scary games at all. I'm a I'm a punk. So. But that I am a punk. I get scared easily. I don't like bugs. I don't like rats and and animals. So I get scared easily. And Jesus was a scary game. Anyway. I mean, specifically um, that part of, of yeah. Days Gone, honestly, it felt like I played through an episode of Walking Dead. Like, it was so cool. Like, I love that part. Really? But, oh, okay. yeah. I thought it was a great, great part. Yeah, I really wish they build that up a bit. Um, And then, oh, the, it was cool because after the words... I, I got a technique where I got my Ripper trophy of killing a or not a Ripper a uh, one of those big bloater things those I forget what they're called yeah yeah where you, ju- I you know shoot you're... them you shoot them about where they're almost dead yeah. and then what I would do is I would knife him roll knife him roll knife him until I got my trophy mm, uh, fine. yeah anyways now, what were you gonna say the point before I mentioned before I started talking I'm almost afraid to say it because I think I just cracked the code right so I want you to say it again I'm gonna have everyone close your okay now we close your eyes but look. Um, it wasn't explicitly said by Naughty Dog, as far as I'm aware, I think. But mm-hmm. some of the people that went to that um, Last of Us Part Two event, where they got to play the game for a little bit and get some, yeah. and get some previews and impressions and all that, um, some of them were being very detailed about the second part of that demo, which was in uh, Washington, where you're facing off against the WLF and you're doing all that. Right now, mm-hmm. if you recall Ellie's mission in that area wasn't it to rescue tommy so are we yeah yeah exactly so that must be taught like what if that is is the ml the wlf guy what if that's the ringleader or whatever is this yeah like are we seeing where tommy is and ellie is outside in washington trying to get to him right now yeah is that what we're seeing i I think i I mean dude so to me that maybe it's like a compound or something yeah be, but yeah i mean i just i just think that that definitely like this looks like a public restroom right so perhaps maybe yeah. they're in like the capitol building of washington or some sort of like governmental building or, or some sort of public building that the, that the wlf um takes refuge in uh maybe mm-hmm. for like some important matters you know what i'm saying like if, if they have i don't know if they have meetings i don't know if they have like girl scout cookie seminars i don't know you know what i'm saying but like maybe so what's up so my thing is, mm-hmm. was it also ever explained as to why Tommy was caught no. by them? No. Or perhaps does he have any relationship with these individuals? I also don't know why they would shave his head. I mean, um, maybe Tommy, maybe, maybe, hmm. So, like, I I definitely think it's Tommy, but, like, I'm just trying to figure out, like, the content. Really, it's hard, Yeah, because, I mean, like, Tommy seemed to be a pretty, pretty, a pretty good gentleman. You know what I'm saying? Um, I know um, he wanted to join the Fireflies. uh, Mm -hmm. And I, did he ever serve in the Fireflies? I don't think he did. Did he? I'm not too sure, to be honest with you. (laughs) Yeah, I'm not sure. But. (laughs) I've only played the game once. Let's, let's go (laughs) super, super theory, right? Like, like, let's Mm -hmm. just go all out right now, right? Let's say. That Tommy did serve in the Fireflies, right? Mm. Got out of it. You know, it was his past. He did his thing. He found uh, uh, the facility that they're at. 
and I forget every name that describes where they're at. Wow, the dam, um, yeah. you know, in there, and uh, you know he builds up this community. Everything's all good. Kumbaya. Ellie and Joel come back at the end of part one after them being there for a little bit in the middle of the game. Cool story, bro. Everything's all good, right? What if the WLF wants information about the fireflies? Or about something. And they know mm -hmm. that this homie was in the Fireflies at one point and might know those things. Or something, uh, you know, something that Tommy knows. Or maybe, or maybe if we're going to go even like, you know, even to extend it a little bit further. Maybe the WLF has always been there, right? And let's say, mm -hmm. uh, you know, the, the WLF and Tommy Settlement have a deal, right? Of like, hey, in terms of any supplies on this side of like some river or like maybe they make boundaries of like, all right, cool. Like, you know, this is our territory, that's your territory. That's cool. It's all good. If you cross over Washington state lines, we will kill you. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Okay. Like if you if you so as even think of breathing on the border, like we will capture you and we will kill you. You know what I'm saying? Like maybe it's something yeah. like that. You know, like maybe maybe there was some sort of truce, truth, truth, truths, truths. Mm -hmm. Damn, I can't talk. That um, that they both had, and maybe for some reason it's broken. I don't know. You know, like I do like your question as to like what is the reason if it's Tommy? Like why? Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, hmm. I was gonna say maybe you can to the identity of the Seraphite in an effort to stop or um, convince Ellie to stop her rage. This game is so weird. It's being marketed like I would like it's just like Death Strand. Like honestly, I'm gonna be quite honest with you. I mean the these episodes help me get a little hype for the game, especially this one, but my hype level has dipped. Oh I'm so significantly I'm, I'm still excited mainly because it's because I don't want to, I don't want to yeah. over like for Uncharted Four. I was constantly hyped. Oh my God, hyped, 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 and it didn't, it didn't disappoint me at all. I just, I don't want to be in that situation where I'm keep over hyping things, and then it's like, oh, it's just a bland story where yeah, Tommy gets captured, Dina does die there, and Ellie, Ellie gets raped, and yeah, she wants to kill a bunch of people. So, you know what I mean? So right. because who knows? It could be that it could be that simple. I doubt it, but it could I, be that yeah. simple. So you, I, I try not to like. Nowadays, I'm trying my best not to overhype it. Right. But it, I, it's just the way this game's been tar uh, teased and promoted is so strange. Like, I, there's no context. There's just. I mean, would you want clips. context like, though? What? I mean, like, I mean, like, you know, they don't want to spoil the game. You know what I'm saying? I like, know, you but a part of me on. does, man. Well, part, I mean, honestly, a part of me does. <laughs> I mean, absolutely. But I would rather know when I play it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, fair enough. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I'd rather know when I play it. But um, I guess I feel you on that. Yeah, no, like I don't understand. Um, but I mean, I'm 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 happy we don't know. You know, like I would, and like that's why I was that's why I opened up this episode with like I like theories that have holes in them. But this one right. there is like so little holes. Like there's you know, yeah. or maybe what I just thought of maybe the WLF or this gentleman over here is hunting the wolf, and maybe he knows that the wolf is residing. Is in Tommy's yeah, yeah. safe haven. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I think that's definitely a possibility. Possibly. I don't know. Let's see. I don't know. I don't know. But do you have any other thoughts on this thing? Like any other thoughts on, on, on Tommy in general, on this on this gentleman, on on this theory at all? You know what I'm saying? Any other closing thoughts? Not 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 entirely, no. Like I think I think it's definitely interesting. Um I think there's been definitely a shift in um, I guess in relation between Ellie um, and and Joel and Tommy, like Ellie seems to be a little closer with Tommy. You know the fact that she's on a mission to supposedly save Tommy. Right. That in itself sounds, but I don't give a fuck who says what. But that sounds bizarre. Like that's just strange to me. Unless she's been asked to by somebody. I don't think it's that. I think it maybe they're on a run and he ends up getting captured somehow um, because of his intel with the Fireflies, perhaps. Um, and maybe they, they figure out that, hey, we heard about this this girl, this, this, this crazy killer, uh, or not crazy killer, sorry, this girl who has a cure. 
right. or some nonsense. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. I like I'm trying to figure like it's so weird. Like like I said, but no, I definitely think it's it's strange. It's it's interesting, but strange that not like there's been a shift. Like Ellie's a lot more geared towards uh Tommy more so than Joel, which is right. interesting. Right. Right. At first it was right. obviously the opposite. Yeah. Absolutely. No, absolutely. Yeah, yes. yeah. And like I think that there's gonna be a lot more to that to explore, but um yeah, that is that's quite interesting. Yeah. But I guess okay, so is this man in the chair? Is the Tommy? I, Final answers? Oh. Yeah, like what is the road to part two of Mark official... down. Oh, are we you wanna add it add it over oh, the yeah. bets? I mean because we down. I mean because we 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 both think it is. You know what I'm saying? You know, I'm gonna disappoint. Just Ooh. just to be just to spin it up a bit. I, I don't want to say I do and I don't, so I'm just going to say I don't think it's Tommy. I was going to say I don't just for the argument's sake, but it's all good. Well, you oh, sure? so so you want to roll with you do or? I'll, I will roll with no. Okay. <laughs> okay, fair enough. I think if that guy, want. he he looks just like Tommy, but like I'm looking at these images and I'm like, I'm sorry, Tommy is, is, a, is a jock or he looks like a jock. I mean. He looks like a cocky jock and it, that kid looks like a scrawny teenager. Yeah, oh. there, there is so, that. But I'm also, sorry. I mean, we don't know how long this man has been in this chair. Maybe he's, you know, a bit, uh, a bit, a bit famined. One might say, you know. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe he, uh, you know, hasn't had a Big Mac in a while. You know. <laughs> I haven't had a Big Mac in years. The Big Mac yeah. is fire. I haven't had it in a while yeah. too, but I know it's fire. Yeah. But, huh? So I'm gonna say no. You're gonna say yeah. It's Tommy. It. It's on. No, the... I'm gonna say no. Oh, okay. Just kidding. Okay. Yeah, 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 I'm saying no. No right. way. Just, just kidding. Then I'll say yes. <laughs> you know what's funny though? What's I'm. I have a picture here, and it's Tommy in a chair. So I found that kind of funny. You know. But anyways, um... I'm looking through the bets. Why did I ever think? Why did I ever think that Metacritic would would, would get a 97? For, for am I insane? For this game? Yeah. Am I crazy? Why you don't you don't think it will? Nah. <laughs> what was you, mine? Ninety four. Yours is ninety two. Eighty nine. Yours. Ninety two. Same. Same. Same with Death Stranding. Interesting. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Actually, I think my. Oh, I can't wait for tomorrow. Oh my god, it's gonna be lit. Um. Oh, dude, I need to get some rest for that. Are you gonna be streaming with with me, or at least like be in the chat, or whatever? Or? If not, like it's cool. But just wondering. Well, what time are you doing that? Twelve, right? I have to see when they go live. It's twelve for you, which is convenient, but for me it's three AM in the morning. It's, and it's, it's I went to bed at like I told you like, is it kind of a bad day today, but like th- I, I didn't go to bed until three AM and I woke up at eight. Eight nine. So I only had six hours of sleep. Let me <laughs> like, that's that so absurd. I can't do that again because I have work on Saturday, so Yeah. yeah. I wanna see. Okay, when did It's not it's twelve for you. I know that for sure. Twelve PM or AM or like one Bruh, twelve AM. In three hours for you. So or it's midnight. It, two hours. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, midnight. Oh, I yeah, thought it was in the hours. morning. Yeah. I thought I was gonna get a little sleep in between. I gotta. Yeah. I you know what? You will be able to. I might just. You know what? I'm probably just gonna stream 8 a.m. tomorrow, my time, and get some okay. sleep, and then just get, let let all of the impressions and reviews flow into Metacritic because it because it will take a while for all of it to come in. Then I'll start shooting. That's true. I'll just I'll That's just stream true. tomorrow morning at eight. I'll I'll all right. have it scheduled Are on. You? On the channel, yeah, yeah, we'll do that. Cause I, 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 I'm not trying to be up at midnight. Forget that. Even though I will be playing games, but yeah. But uh, I can't. All right. So tired. So this gentleman in the chair, I say yes. Stark says no. We will know when the full game comes out. But until that point, make sure to keep it locked here on the channel to keep it on the podcast road to part two last of us and last of us part two podcast you can definitely like the video if you enjoyed that as well as say subscribe to push in source to keep up with the latest and greatest in playstation of course down below you can find our links our twitter link as well as our discord to follow us on there and join the join the discord server because there's lots of a section in there you can throw in any topic ideas or any questions or thoughts or whatever you want to do put it in that chat as well as uh, you know talk with us on the Discord chat, the best place to get, you know, hold of me or a hold of Christian or or a hold of Starks as well. But also, you can get a hold of Starks on his different platforms. Starks, take it away. Such Where as? Find you? Such as good old YouTube.com. Uh, especially if you're interested in some Death Stranding stuff. Absolutely. 
as well as which have been doing pretty pretty good as as of late but mm. as well as twitter good old twi- twitter so yeah mm. yes, and you sir. you you can follow me of course on twitter at the k diaz one two three follow me on there uh we'll have uh you know i've been playing some modern warfare that's been cool you know what i'm saying uh i'm almost done with ori in the blind forest that's cool next up we got of course dead stranding and of course star wars Jedi fallen order a lot of good stuff here on the position side as well as uh on, on my side as well you can follow me on those things and uh yeah and i guess we'll call that an episode thing of oh screw forgot if you're listening to this on bod and are not aware you can get all of our long form content on our anchor link down below in the description you can find our anchor link where you can go and follow our various links to apple Podcasts, google play podcast as well as spotify and any major podcast service all you gotta do is search up ps not ps playstation source podcast feed or go on the link in the description where you can get uh, all those other links to the service that you most use thank you for watching and as always greatest awaits